of this mod here. That I think I'd like to try out. Just got it a few minutes ago. It's obviously called HMS Defiance 2. I have no idea what it is. I'm just gonna give it a shot. Okay. Turn down the anti-aliasing. A few weeks won't have to worry about anti-aliasing. Or the noise that my graphics card's fan is making. 1942, eh? Oh. Source engine, you've got some settings to change. Alright. Had to turn up the mouse sensitivity to about 7. Might be too high. I'll fix it later. Even though that really doesn't work that well, but... Whoa! Hello there. Hey there. Very, very poorly made radio-looking thing. Hi, bird! Hi, <laughs> dresser! I think this is more ridiculous. Tell nobody. Not even her. Okay, let's talk. Costs lives. Oh, what to victory? Ammo, eh? the door. Oh. One is either a German or a Christian. You cannot be both. I guess I'm German then. Huh? Eh. Cool. I didn't know that he really said that? Well, now I, I don't even know what that is. Whatever. Better potluck than humble pie. Don't waste food. With Churchill today. Oh, better potluck with Churchill than humble pie under Hitler. What's wrong with humble pie? With Hitler. Huh. Couldn't they just change their uniforms on the spot though? I mean... Talk less, you'll never know. Yeah, that's... I guess that's true. Talk about an air of paranoia, though. Why do I need this gun and this thing? Hi. How are you? Ah, Stephen. I have an important job for you today. Okay. I need you to pick something up for me. A book, to be exact. It is no ordinary book, however is said to contain all knowledge. Whether you believe that is unimportant, I still want you to get it for me. Go down to okay. the armory and gear up. You are heading into the library of all knowledge. It's likely that you'll be resisted. You see, the library is protected by a rather enthusiastic cult. They call themselves the Guardians. Right. You are more than able to handle yourself, however. I don't believe they are any match for you. Okay. Bring me back the book, and I wish you the best of luck. You sure do like lemurs, don't you? I don't. I hate lemurs! Hate them! Hate! Hate! Hate!
I like swords, though. Can I have your sword? How are you supposed to get it if I can't break it with this wrench? Can I have your book? It's okay, I'll just knock it away from him. Nope, forgot my dresser. I'll be taking that. And your skull. Good day, sir. that book go? There it is. He's not present. He's over there. Man. These pages must be glued together. I think I'd rather have the skull. Get out of here. No one likes you. There's a mess out here. Just letting you know. There's a mess there, too. Maybe that'll teach him to do his own dirty work. Oh, yeah. Let's leave you here. Ah, oh, crap. Can't pick up this table. So can't. Oh, wait, there we go. Oh, that door's open now. Get in there. There. There's no way the captain will see... Hi. You want to greet me? Oh, I get it. The guy who made this didn't want to lip sync anybody, ah, so he used my mask Lord idea. Cartwright. As you know, my name's Ghoul Fisher. What you didn't know about is this teleporter. Not surprising, as very few people know about it. Why do you have a teleporter? I built it, and the captain is going to be testing it. No uh, point his journal's going to be testing it first. I'd probably never see it again. All you need to know about the teleporter is that it opens a gateway from the ship to a program location. In theory, it could teleport you anywhere in the known universe. That's pretty cool. Now, enough chit chat. Let's get this show on the road. Oh, really? Referencing the original game, huh? Doesn't seem safe. Wow, oh, those are some strong icicles. That's some cold water. Well. On this site stands the Library of All Knowledge. The library is not an archive of books, but rather the residing place of one particular book, the Book of All Knowledge. The Book of All Knowledge was created by the makers of the library, the librarians. The librarians' objective in creating the library was to spend no spread knowledge to those worthy. 
Oh, and there's a problem there, you see. Librarian apostrophe S. That indicates there was one librarian. Anyway, a book, the Book of All Knowledge, was created as an ultimate source of information. The librarians, however, saw the danger in free and unlimited knowledge, and so a f small defense group was formed who would worship the book and the librarians. They were, and still are, willing to throw down their life to defend the book. Even to this day, 3,000 years after the librarians' deaths, there is a reasonable number regarding the book. Okay. And it paused all particles around me as well. Why didn't they just break the book, huh? If you believe yourself fit to enter the Library of All Knowledge, then proceed. The Library of All Knowledge is protected by guardians who will only allow worthy people access to the Book of All Knowledge. These guardians reside permanently in the library, and are willing to sacrifice themselves for the protection of the book. There is very little more than, or more to fear than unlimited knowledge in the wrong hands. Ah, a metal glowing gem. Open the... Open the door. Welcome to the Library of All Knowledge. What you see before you is the work of the librarians. The librarians, in their greatness, constructed this great library. While it no doubt will suffer damage over the many years of testing, it will always be here for those worthy. The guardians of the library will ensure that no unworthy blood leaves the great library. Oh, God! Okay, I didn't expect there to be killing already. In 1931, one of the sacred guardians of the library attempted to steal the Book of All Knowledge to go on a quest to procure immortality. He was, of course, stopped by the loyal guardians. They did not, however, manage to capture him and enact the ritual of punishment. One day, however, he will pay for his treachery and failure to receive punishment. Interesting. And that's loud. All members of the Guardians will receive a weekly blessing with the book in the prayer room. 